Science and Technology Minister Dr. Monica Msenero, flanked by officials from Kira Motors, handed over the keys of the new Kyola diesel bus to Uganda Airlines officials in Entebbe. This custom designed bus tailored to the customer specific needs falls under the Euro for Emission Standards of Sustainable Transportation. It's a show off. It has an onboard clean, what you would call relate to uh, an, an airplane toilet. So for convenience purposes, uh, you don't have to make stops for this purpose. Uh, secondly, uh, this bus comes with an all-point air conditioning system. So at every seat, the people on board have access and can control their own air conditioning. It has, of course, it boasts with two flippable uh, screens for entertainment on board. It has what we call a PA system, public address system, both for the driver and also for the narrator on board. Then, of course, it has been made with the most exquisite and premium materials. The leather seats, as you've seen, the premium material for the uh, interior panels, the exterior has been designed and customized to the customer's requirements. And um, the other aspect that we can boast of this is that it has heated side mirrors. For this one, it's a push of a button. Give it a few seconds and you're ready to go for your journey. Dr. Msenero reveals that Kira Motors' order book for both electric and diesel buses has grown exponentially. Since, since we started uh, really demonstrating that we have mature technology uh, and we have worked very closely with many clients, CAA, to test our technology. Otherwise, the orders are more than the buses that we have, but we shall keep churning them off. Captain Stephen Wegoy, who received the bus on behalf of Uganda Airlines, emphasized the airline's dedication to the Buy Uganda, Build Uganda initiative in their operations. And we have tested the product and we, we have loved it. Yeah, and we would need them. And some of these buses, we may need them specifically for the airside. The airside buses are not the same as the one we use on the land side. Land side is away from the airport. Mm -hmm. So uh, we shall sit down on that note when the management makes a decision on when to get more buses and we discuss on that. Britam Insurance Company has also provided a comprehensive coverage for this bus. What we are giving Uganda Airlines is an enhanced third party. In other words, anything that this bus should cause that belongs to a third party shall be compensated by Britam up to a tune of 800 million Ghana shillings. That is 200 million Ghana shillings for a bodily injury, 300 million for a series of injuries, and then 300 million for property that the bus may harm. Have you gone to a tailor before for a bespoke outfit? Well, that is exactly what Uganda Airlines did with this bus. They placed an order and specifications, and Kira Motors Corporation was ready to serve them. Four weeks later, you're looking at the very first Kayola diesel bus with the VIN number of 0001. Sharon Chomdisha, UBC News.